Resolution 787 clearly defines the scope of NDC. It's an XML-based standard that enables airlines to respond to shopping requests coming from travel agents. But it also includes in its scope a set of standards for order management, which means that should an airline decide or choose to do so, they will also be able to carry out the booking, the payment, the ticketing process. And finally, NDC supports comparison shopping. As a result, it will support, of course, the aggregation function. Now, what's important to note, NDC is not mandatory. If you don't want to do it, you do not have to do it. It's flexible. If an airline, with their partners, choose to do just one of the components of NDC, shopping in particular, then of course they can do that. It's their decision. If there's a requirement for what we call integration, if there's a need for standards to help plug into today's process, then we'll support the industry in delivering these standards. And finally, NDC supports interlining. I'd like to close with just three points that are very important of what NDC is not. NDC is not a system. It's not a database. It's not a piece of software. It's just a standard for exchange of data between airlines and travel agents based on modern technology. It's the IT providers who make it into systems and software. NDC is a standard.